VOD reviews. They, they've happened again for D2, and our B&B going to have a couple more tricks up their sleeve than they did a few days ago. Yeah, we'll definitely have to wait and see, because the last time these guys played each other, I mean, Nikiz was the player that really shined outside of this. I mean, he had a rating of a 1.74. That's nuts. And I mean, the fact that he was essentially 28 and 16, he was just making so much impact. I think he had about 115 ADR, but we'll have to see if that's going to be the case now. B&B &B starting on that T side, Pain Gaming on the CT. This is where they struggled a little bit last time they met, so we'll have to be if that will be the destiny here today. Pain Gaming need this map to stay alive, and PKL already starting things off very well, holding the fort as much as possible, but shots are being missed, and bodies are dropping, but they're dropping on Pain Gaming. Oh, man. This is not looking like the start Pain Gaming wanted for this pistol. Expensive as it may be. That CT is, we always tell the tale of an old war damage being inflicted. They're trying to go through door, but there's a couple more. They're just falling. Stacked bodies all over B site, and three players are going to have the might to pull it through. BNB &B with the pistol. Whew. All right, BNB. &B. The last time these guys were able to play each other, this was a 10 5 half on Dust 2. And I talked about this. This was only just like three days ago. So the, the history's there. They were able to get the demo reviews, the VOD reviews. Pain Gaming, not really showing us their best on Inferno, but this is a chance where they can. They have a 6-0 record on Dust2, so this should be a big nail-biter. And already now, B&B &B have been able to get this long A control. Already obtaining it, and nobody from Pain Gaming making their presence known yet, but they have this mid control, Kappa. This is a little bit interesting now. This is fantastic for them. That's so much info. Right? You might not have the guns, but you've got knowledge, and knowledge is power. Our position being held in any site here. That's the game. Could you two use here? Roll well, that news bears, but that one peak, that's deadly for Big Zero. It's going to get up to 4 and 4. Good control we see from BNB, &B, not just overexerting themselves. Patiently waiting to take this site. They know there's pistols they're up against, which does favor the up close. Personal combat, some good reply. Hardzell somehow wins that from a long range. Wish I could do that, but I can't. But bad news bears now should be able to pull this back. And now Pain Gaming will retreat the plan and preserve the two weapons away. Cup. Take that scout. Take the MP9. And yeah, that that kind of that's like a scope on the MP9. Uh, I think from from hard. That was that was mental. Taking a, a shot to the face. Courtesy of that frag, though, and yeah, going to force the save as we will. Bad news, Bears. Let's talk about from what we've seen so far. So aggressive. Like, just the whole W strats. That's, that's what they're doing. And it, you know what? It works with us, too. You get rewarded for the hyper-aggression as long as you can get the trade. Good trades in from B&B, &B, and that is going to lock it down for the 2-0. So Payne not able to take the second round away, which we always talk about, which is just as important as the pistol round. Still have the scout ready. Not going to expect much to be invested from them this round. So put a little bit more pressure for PKL. And also hards out to see what they can find. Some good molly usage. Pushing back the player not to just go into lore B right away. Allowing Bad News Bears to have some more control and presence of B... I'm waiting things out. Another molly it again. Just any cheeky plays will not be allowed for the time being. Yes. That cheek, that sass, we denied. We're getting too spicy too early. Thank you very much. Util. Almost non existent here for, for Pain Gaming. And yeah, obviously, it's just this, this eco, this pistol buy for them. But either way, not a good vibe. Just over a minute left. And BNB &B just. Just bleeding that clock and just taking their time. No need to rush. B and B now do you have con cat control? CTs have made their rotate. Oh, B wills capitalizes on the opportunity. He seizes it. So for the CTs, they're trying to see if they can find this lurk of shake, which they will. So that's a good pickup. The Galil will be in this plan, but. Look at the stack. Oh my. Oh, what? 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 That, okay. 
Someone's pushed up cat. I guess they know more than us. That's why they're in the server getting it done right now. Four versus three. This could be a good retake. They have the velocity behind this, but the Galils, they have been demons with the Galils and BNB. Still looking to take this one away, regardless of the heroics coming out of a game. Oh, beautiful. Oh, the threat is gone. A valiant effort from Payne to try to go for the, the, the retake on Cat like that. And like you said, I mean, if they were going to be able to go for that next frag, that would have been critical for them potentially getting that retake situation to go in their favor. But bad news bears will take the 3-0. Still have the bit of the bonus. Swisher will keep the Mac 10, which we should expect him to see either going towards Cat or even lower B to just find anybody that might try to get up close and personal for the time. But op will be for safe. And Bolt Jr., we talked about this in the green room. This is where the head-to-head -head is almost dead even when you look at the op stats. Yeah. I, you, you read my mind, pal. I was about to mention that. The, the op gladiator battle. The Sparta oh, battle no! shall begin. It's not going to get a chance to at this rate, though. A1S spraying and causing so much arrest. And oh, my goodness. The frags continue. It's a four versus two. Long A. Oh, it's closed. Oh, my goodness. The fact that Big Uzera was able to bypass everybody. Just a margin of timing. Safe, Safe. now. He's made his presence. The boost! Oh! That is so cheeky, but Junior with a no-scope. A great fashion. One on two. Bomb still controlled. Waiting things out. Smoke blocking it off. Oh, the timing. He missed it. There is another smoke he can use, but he needs to get hard, okay. Zell. And the crab spray will work, and... Pain Gaming have been able to pick themselves up. Double ops ain't even around. So there you have it. Pain Gaming giving us a little, uh, a little notice. Say, hey, we are, we are good on D2. And you said it. The stats don't lie. Oh, boy. This is a barn burner. I can already feel it. Feel it in your veins. And you can feel it even more so. Because you've got the, the Pug Special. Two... Ops in pain game in hands. One of them's gonna be at long here for safe. Not hitting the shot, but gonna fall back and hope for better times. Full rotation coming up for bad news bears. Let's listen, there's an op long. Let's, let's not do it, guys. Let's not push that. Even that flash that came through. Iggy's there was trying to see if he could get get through and get a little bit of a quick frag, fall back. Positioning from B and B. Oh, reads that play for the time. Very slow round from Bad News Bears. They have not gone for the long A control this time. A little bit of a delay hit potentially, but they will actually change up their strategy. A very different setup from both teams. We, have, we don't actually even see pain going for this control of long. And they put a little bit more pressure on double stacks on both sites. After the, the round they just had at long A, I think it's understandable for, for both teams to just <laughs> take it back a notch, right? The high progression of playing gaming, it worked. But for Bad News Bears, they've got to reassess things. And back to the review boards. Let's take a step back and say, okay, are they going to give us anything for free? But not this level of play. And I think it's the problem now. You've got 25 seconds and they've, they've not done anything. They've not made any progress. Hards out. 20. This, the time is just running low. Hards out finds it. It's all about staying alive now. Bad News Bears, they're in the hot seat. They need to take down these players, but no way are they going to be able to pass. None shall pass. This is Pain Gaming's territory. And they able to convincingly take this round away. Bad News Bears run the clock too low. We're run round away from a tie game. It's going to be a save that we see from the B&B team. Yeah, you know, that, that's concerning, lads. I'm going to say it as it is. That's concerning because the response to having that long A push that we just saw from Pain Gaming two rounds ago, Bad News Bears, they seem to get locked up a bit there. They weren't too confident in what to do. And it doesn't matter what you do, make that play with confidence. But right there, they hesitated way too long and uh, that's got to cost them. Pain Gaming back to a double stack. Inside of B. Having both PKL playing in the closet as well as having Hard Zhao on the B platform. Bad News Bears just doing a little bit of exploring as much as they can. No contention for the mid. So they do have 
Quite a few flashes that's going to allow them to get some control. Flashes in middle, which does cause a little bit of potential rotate. You can already see the CTs. They're starting to uh, get a little interested. They're starting to bite a little bit. Three. Here, curious. Here has to kill the cat low, and uh, no one looking to be killed or fragged just yet. Taking their sweet time. B-Wheels coming through and not taking the time at all. Takes an op to the body. Safe says we take those and looking like it's going to be a straight take here for Pain Gaming. The rifles are there. The bomb's going to go down though. That's good news for the bad news bears. But these frags, well, it's raining and it's raining Pain. Pain Gaming, take another. Raining Pain indeed. I mean, for Bad News Bears, that, that was a great round. I mean, they were able to get the control of Cat. They got the bomb down. That allows the loss bonus plus the plant coming in. So now Junior does have his off. A big key of success for Bad News Bears. We talked about when this guy can get a big green in his hands. He can be the meet your maker. I'll have to wait and see now. Can he find himself this pick in mid? Safe actually will go for the contention, but we'll back off. Nothing will happen here. Long control. Hardzo oh. actually puts that off into work. So the double off from Pain it's starting to look pretty good. Safe losing that now. Four and four. You, you can tell how even this is. It's just, it's an eye for an eye kind of game. A little push here from Neckers. This is, that's huge. That info. Let alone the frags, lads. He knows. He knows they're pushing mid. Oh, this is so big. This is huge. Oh, he's spammy. He's made, he's made He's made the aware. He has the information, though. So you can see the rotate's coming in. Pain Gaming can now position themselves in a great spot. Smoke's going to come in. Spongy yeah. will win that. But Big Uzera able to help him out. He's being able to be the big firing assistance with a triple. And just that play alone from the Keys. I talked about his importance the last time they played Dust 2. But that play was the most impactful allowing them to go for the rotate, which bad news bears that looked like they could have had it. And it's, it goes to show, right? It's not about thirsting for the frag. You didn't see the whole W knife play that they're just running like, I've got to frag them. No, no, just get the comms, get the comms out there. And so much comms that it's forcing BNB onto a timeout. And I, I like this because they need to talk about what just happened. What did we do wrong? Who wasn't watching the flank? And what do we need to do different? A quick timeout. So some definitive decisions here for BNB. This is four rounds in a row that we've seen from Pain Gaming to bring back through. I mean, Bad News Bears had the 3-0. And yeah. then pretty much it's just been raining pain, like you said. And now, I mean, even for Bad News Bears, it's starting to look a little more bad as they only have Junior with a scout. Deagles will be there. Oh, All the oh, he's a magician. He just knew. He just knew that was going to be happening. So he just didn't go for the fight. But Nikki's again, able to find this mid control. Pushes this back from Bad News Bears. Could be big if Shay could find it, but no. Made. Oh, the, the one oh. combo. The, the, the players, the bait and switch, the oh. trade coming through, and it's going to be safe finishing things up with the op from bottom mid. Whoa, 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 then. A reset again for BNB, but economy discipline? Fantastic for BNB. &B. But what? That's not what I'm concerned about. I'm not concerned about the finances. I'm concerned about their picks. They're not picking up the frags that we saw the pick up on Inferno. And that confidence, it seems to be dwindling away. It really is. And I mean, even when we saw this in the last time they played each other, that, oh. it's almost looking like a, a rinse and repeat from the same thing. I mean, Bad News Bears had the three. They lost the first. Bad News Bears were able to kind of get the response back a little it's bit nice. earlier, but it will be pain. Starting to really put some good counter-aggression onto the Bears. Making them second-guess their plan. And shaking in their boots. B-Wills trying to cause some commotion over at B-Halls, but I don't think the bait's really going to be bitten. Saying that, let's have a look at the distribution of players right now. 3A. So, yeah, that hasn't worked at all. The, the fake didn't do what it was supposed to, and a minute is left. They've got to do something. And once again, Pain Gaming, they've got these aggro positions. They've got the fall off trades. I just don't see them. I don't see them crumbling here. 
So lots of utility to save as well. I mean, there is about 40 seconds left. Now we can see the molly is going to be used. Again, just running the clock super low. Problematic for the bears. Waiting things out. Biggie's arrow going to go for the first point. As soon as he sees somebody, he will fall back. He's got his teammates there close by to help him. Oh, the the mollies. The... This is this is horrific. This is like a torture chamber. This is the save. We're, we're, there should no be no reason for bad new bears to go for this. The discipline of utility usage from Pain Gaming allows them to get this. PKL, oh, no. seeing what he can find. Won't be able to find himself a kill, but that's all right. And now the hunt's not looking too good as it looks good for the bears. They're able to get a good bite or two. Uh, no harm, no foul. I mean, everybody from Pain Gaming have about, you know, 7,000 that you can still see. 12K. 12K, for... 11K. There's like, so much money. Like, you don't ever... You, that never happens. You don't talk about that on CT ever. It's always the opposite. It's the T's that are just running away with the, the money. Especially not a close qualifier, right? Like, we saw Inferno, neck and neck, Econ, trade for trade, trade for trade in the buys. But for this one, it definitely seems more one-sided. And, uh... That hot take that I delivered at the end of Mat One. Well, it's looking uh, it's looking a bit lukewarm right now. Timeout comes through. So this is gonna just again clear the comms, figure things out. But six rounds in a row that we have now seen from Pain Gaming. Miraculous CT side. Whereas I said before. Their CT, when they played against each other last, wasn't, you know, the greatest. I mean, it was a 10-5, so they're starting to really do a lot better than the last time they played, and Bad News Bears need to start reevaluating the plan of attack. You do. You tell is just... It's not what they want it to be as well, right? Like, you go for that flash, it's got to be your flash for your XE. You can't really go for those fakes. PKL, once again, at it with these antics, these... These nasty lurks and they push through. We talked of info that we saw from the long push. Oh, the time it could be immaculate here. Okay. Oh, PKL. PKL. Just, just picking them apart from B tunnels. We we talked about this in the pre-show. I mean, it was it was about the firefight, right? I said the quality that we saw from oh. Pain Gaming. They just, they really are another level. And Bad News Bears know this. I think Pain Gaming have been able to wake up a little bit now. Feeling a bit more confident on a, a map they're familiar with. A map that they've been undefeated on as a group. In a long period of time. And Junior only able to find one of them. 7-3 we go. Do we see another timeout come through? This might not be the round, considering this will be most likely a light eco. Tech Nines and Deagles. Expecting either a long A push or maybe even potential B hit. But the B has not been really uh, good to them, Kappa. No, it hasn't. The window and door hold have been devastating. And I was about to say, Pain Gaming, they look so comfortable now. They look relaxed. Sit back on the couch with uh, the keyboard on your lap kind of deal with the uncomfortable nature for bad news bears yeah they look like they're sweating bullets right now good little push here from spongy i say that and oh my goodness the tech nine the rec nine coming through and it's been decent so far it's been good for two though oh my goodness it will be what what sort of round is this pain gaming not expecting this aggression they saw the molly and smoke so they can block off the b tunnels you can flush a few people out now. Swisher close. He hears them. He knows they're by. He's just spamming away. And this is now Big Uzera, but not able to find more than two. And Bad News Bears take a round finally. After seven in a row, it's a four to seven score line. It's not over yet. We talked about it being a barn burner. I definitely still expect this. That's what we wanted, and that's what we needed to see out of BNB. Get those pistols, put them right in Pain Gaming's face, and do not give them a chance to flank. And I think that might have been the conversations of those timeouts. Like, listen, guys, we've got to push them, right? It doesn't... Oh, so close there for Junior getting that early pick from Speedway. 
Put the hell off that afterwards, though. But that's the aggression, the momentum that we need to see built up here from BNB. I'd expect to see more discipline here from Pain Gaming. They've tried these lurks. They've been punished for the lurks. And okay, there you go. Aggro plays still being read like a book here from BNB. They're stacking up the rounds, surely. Zera goes for a swing. He's able to get one hit. The response comes back. The double boost. PKL should be able to find this planter, but the smoke blocks it off. No. A spongy. He soaks up a frag. Now it's going to be an attempt from Hardzow and Spongy still in that premium sponge. Leading safe by himself on a one on four. Not the greatest position to be in. Doesn't even go for the jump spot. Not going to risk it. He might try to wait things out. See if they expected him to rotate out. But Spongy should be able to spot this. I think safe knows he's not in a safe position. Yeah, you got to be, you got to be fallen here. you got to be classic fallen. <laughs> like this is this has to be magic if you're to do something here is safe but i'm not expecting too many magic tricks off of what we've seen here from bnb but i think you're right i think he's playing for he's playing for the late defuse maybe at least to exit if he can because he, he knows they can't stay here long enough there you go spongy gets the rotate so now he's trying to see if he can escape oh safe gonna be activated safe.exe gets himself to save that op a great play. Good discipline. And B and B, we saw they didn't really even double check that spot. No. And the timing couldn't have been better. And look at the money now, lads. They can barely buy a full five. That's the kind of impact that we're seeing from safe. And all those stats that we've researched and that you've been educating to me within the CSGO realms, particularly for safe and junior, it is all coming to fruition. Double up set up, and I'm talking one apiece here. One for pain, one for BNB. Not to forget and not to ignore BNB. A Tech 9 false push has led to this economy now. So it's mighty thin. They're walking on the thinnest device, but there is a hope that BNB can get a few more in the bag. Saying that. Okay. Junior. Oh no, it's Swisher. He's getting roasted alive. He has the high. Goes for it, but PKL. Gonna take him down. Right. So the trades are here. Hards out. Oh, he's gonna run through oh, this! No, 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 he's no. a madman! How does this happen? Hards out! You are absolutely filthy! But it will be his teammates to help him out. My god, the heroics through the fire and flames. Bad news bears do not expect it. Oh, why would you? Why would you expect someone to push through a molly in the last 20, 30 seconds of a round? Yeah, that's like, it's like a fireman running into a, a building on fire. Saves the day. Saves the kitten from the tree. The kitten be in pain. My goodness. Eight to five we go. Do you have enough money in the bank for Bad News Bears to get for her full gun round one more time? But very important for them. We're on round 14, so... Bad News Bears really needing to pull things back. Their CT side on this map... It's not been the greatest in favor for them when they last played. We'll have to see if history can still show itself now in the presence. Is today even going to be a... Is it long? The lights are playing game. Good late, you too. He wills. Blind as a bat. Manages to take out Neg. But oh, R2's oh, right there. Right there for the trade. And R2. Oh! Is that a collat? I think it was. I think it was a oh, collat. Oh my goodness. Clap, clap. Spongy open. And the Hail Mary nade. To finish the job. Big Uzera. Able to get himself to 14 and 7. Both him and Hardzow have pushed. Mid-range double digits. I talked a lot about safe. I said he's a, he's a big key for these guys, but all players can contribute. We're really seeing it here. That be on, my friends. Financial woes burden the Bears right now. And oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Early pick coming in from safe. Now it is to be a B. They didn't have many weapons to talk of anyway, but now. To four, one deagle, two galils, and a scout. Let's 
safe. Taking a different page out of the book here. And you're not aggro over that cat step as well. But this is the thing about safe. He plays safe, then he plays aggro. He plays safe, he plays aggro. Such a dynamic offer. How do you predict where he's going to be? That's what you, exactly what you need from your opera too. Just that unpredictability. You said it. Safe's been able to get some great ground, great positioning. And the positioning's looking pretty good if I'm paying. Okay, PKL will be able to help him out. I thought it was him at first, but... Two on five and Galil's are flying. Not going to be a long flight, though. Swish already down to 39. This is looking like it's a... A 10-5, and it will be a 10-5 as pain now. We're going to be switching things over. We're going to take a short break. We'll be right back. Well, we're back, and pain has definitely been the whole theory here for Bad News Bears. Only getting five rounds on that first half. We're now switch things over. Map number two, where the first map has been in favor for B&B, &B, but we'll have to see if they can survive this. Laz and Cup of Frag with you here today for the NA ESL challenger Anaheim, Anaheim, sorry, close qualifiers. Yes, indeed. The pain train being brought in full force here in that first half. If you missed it, oh dear. High damage. Already, already the dink to be wills. And that's not even going to enable much. The trade has gone through, though. Salvaged on the Hunt's biggest era, though. Look at it go. Yeah, they're bloodthirsty. They're feeling very good from that first half. Shake. Oh, get the USPs going. Will be junior to find this, though. Down in the keys by himself. Will be caught in the crossfire. So, Bad News Bears will be able to take both pistols this map. It's going to be very important they do not lose this second. We talked about this earlier on, but when you're on that CT side, this second round is, in my opinion, way more important than the pistol because if they lose this, Pain Gaming, they have an opportunity to scrape on quite a few rounds. You're done straight they do, man. That, that's exactly it, right? CT's expense, it needs to be built up nice and early. Otherwise, you're just chasing. You're chasing that dub the entire game long. And not just chasing the dub, you'll be chasing a team all the way to the, the third of a best of three. A1S out here for Spongy. The double A1S set up the fam as the two MP9s. Is it going to be sublime? That util, that nade. Look at the damage already. Oh, Junior. Oh. In front of Danger. Oh, Junior is just path statting. He's got headshot. himself triple. Headshot. And, uh, I think that's three headshots, mate. I think it is. Biggie Zera almost able to take down. I believe that was Shake. So, here we are. Two rounds go for B&B. &B. Now the economy can start to build up, but Pain Gaming will be bringing some heat to see what they can do. No op available, of course, from Bull Squads. I'm curious what the plan will be here, Cup. I mean, we have seen pain. They're getting quite a bit of control very quickly. There you go. Hard out. Trying to kick the door open to long A. Does have the door open ajar. And uh, can invite the team through as well. The spray coming through Ooh. as well from Big Azera. Go on. Go on, Big Azera. You can unleash and shake. Spraying a bit too hard. And that will be pain that are able to cause more of a wrecking pain. The wrecking ball has made it through. Keeping the Bad News Bearers back into a save. They have the 5100 available for Shake. But I can't imagine they want to put a big investment on this. We don't want to see that Hercules play. We don't want to see the heroic with one gun. I'm curious again what, to, what we will find. We haven't seen them try anything, you know, out of the ordinary. Uh, you know, anything that's surprising those big stacks i feel like that we typically do but so far in this best of three we haven't and now we do freebie here is going to i think that's going to be AK acquired too that'd be such an upgrade but no the access denied oh there we go things are definitely looking a little hard oh testing a mouse one works as well there from playing gaming it's working confirmed and uh, the frags continue. Big Zero kicking at 18 frags. Hearts out. 21 frags. If you look on the other side, Laz, it's for B&B. &B, just 
they haven't got revved up this game. They haven't had an opportunity because Pain Gaming keep taking away that opportunity and that privilege to uh, get into Dust2. They really have. In Pain Gaming, they, like we said, they played each other before just recently. And Pain Gaming are showing why they are undefeated on this. Ooh. Oh, okay. Big Uzera now turning into the entryer, the big entry. Bad news bears. In this kind of a situation, five players alive from pain. You say they, they, you go for the save. They don't have enough to really get control. Of this even shake. Look at this. He hesitates too much. Oh no! And now, what once was four bears is just down to two. And they just need to keep these guns preserved as much as possible. B wills is still trying to tap away, but. Will not be enough in the DM server, keeping Junior by himself, the Lone Ranger. See what he can scope out. And the hunt is coming in a little bit from Big Uzera. Yeah, because they can. They've got the plant, they've got the round advantage. Who'd want to deny Oh, he hits stuff. this! Oh, that was, a, was that a leg? He hit him! He hit him midair. Oh, and he gets taken down! Oh, Big U gets rewarded with the frag and an op and a round. Safe now, doesn't even have to worry about it. $8,300 he has available. Pain Gaming have not slowed down. And it's looking like now, Bad News Bears might be looking themselves to going the distance, but still a little bit of time left that they can bring things back, Kappa. Yeah, no, I admit, I'm taking that hot take back. It's cold now. I said it's lukewarm. It's ice cold. Because Pain Gaming, they're ice cold as well. They have not held back at all. The, the velocity, the aggression, the belief that you can see in Pain Gaming. No, oh, you, you can't deny it. And the frag coming through a bit. Well, and again, you know, just the other day when they when they played each other. Oh, okay, okay. Well, hang on, a, hang on a second. Hold up. Hold the phone. It's bad news. Bears calling. Got themselves two guns. You wills. Okay. okay. 50-50 chance, and he gets it. So nope. That's going to force Big Uzera off of longs. The plan was, okay, I'm thinking of going for long. The bomb's recovered. But is the round going to be able to be recovered? More of a question for B&B. &B. So many heroics here. Swisher trying to hold CT. Has the cross covered as well. He wheels like, I'm not sure. Are they B? Are they A? And that's the problem with this team, as I mentioned. So unpredictable. You've got to have head on a swivel. That's coming through. So big, you're gonna plan in front of the default box, which allows his teammate, which will be PKL, to go down long. But look at this, bad news bears, a wolf pack or a bear pack, I guess. I don't think it's a thing. But PKL though, he wins it. Oh, There's no that's... threat at all. Bad no. news bears, so close. That's that's so unfortunate. The the hyper aggression, the timing has been sensational immaculate for him playing game in this game and 14-7 you don't even need to hear me say that to get that understanding the full buyer is going to come through here for b and b but this is the last chance saloon otherwise eco it is gonna be in the garbage it really really will be short sure, you got lost bonus but that only goes so far to, to get you that full buy this is it this is now the round we're at round 22 bad news bears we gotta make sure these guns can rattle some heads. They need to take this to keep their contention alive. Otherwise, this could be over very quickly for map number two. And safe does have the mid. So Pain Gaming could split into this B site. The bomb is still in the back outside on T side, outside of B. They will retrieve it now. With this much control. Gonna make it a little bit more difficult for the Bad News Bear Swisher. He has the sound cues, but oh, he does he expect this? He will. Okay. Has the Junior. Junior's even better though. Hard sell. 48 seconds. Has his sights. Junior. On the greatest spot. Oh, look at that! He was looking to make a haircut, but Spongy will be able to help him out. Bad news bears do survive with four players, so they can still get the force for B-Wills. Still have the op. 
which is going to be very important. And this op needs to now bite. Is it ever? We need to see first blood here from B&B. We need to stop pain gaming in their tracks if you are bad news bears and you want any opportunity, any chance at making this a game. Or oh, inevitably, that, that third map is going to be right there. I doubt. Hard on the aggression. Nothing's changed and continuing that over at long. Pain Gaming really waiting things out too. They're not even going for the, any advancement of long. Like they have the big pit, so now they can just leave safe if they want. They can go back, fight for mid control. Which might be not the plan. The keys will be able to one for the peak. Look at that, he finds it. Spongy does not expect it. The duelers are coming in favor now for pain. Someone needs to wake up and Junior, he gets tapped a little bit. Let's see what he can find. This is rough, Laz. This this spells safe territory for you and they know that. They don't want to accept it, but you've got to. You need to salvage these weapons or it is going to be night night. See you later for next round anyway. And again, yeah, it's, it's such a good point, Cuppa, because, I mean, when you're the CT side, it's that more of an extra importance that you keep these guns. You, you can't just, you know, risk hunts or trying all these big retakes, especially when you don't really have a lot of control. Oh, Junior. Oh, no. B-Wells, okay. We'll be able to get a little bit of retaliation. If he can pick up the kids as well, that'll be very good and very okay. important, because now he's got the AWP. Oh, no way he gets this! Ooh. Gets a nice little 4K, it's exits. Now, we're on map point for paying gaming. Like, in the bigger picture, Laz, that does do some econ damage. You're seeing some hesitation in the buys there, so are exits ever irrelevant? Not at all. But at this stage in the game, with a seven round lead, it isn't as impactful as it needs to be. And map point is right on the doorstep here of paying gaming to send it to the map three. Last time they played, it was a 16-12 pain gaming. Wanting to up the stakes a little bit. Making a bit more convincing. Keys. Okay. Overreaching a little bit with the MAC-10. Swatted away by B&B. Pain gaming really want to continue that flawless victory streak here over on Dusty. B and B are the, the traffic controllers trying to redirect them and say, listen, no no, this is this is gonna be a two and oh. Stop it. The positioning is so off right now from B and B. They have the double player on cat. Allowing long to be controlled. And now it's gonna be a group effort from pain. Good Molly to burn a little bit of time. So plenty of it for pain. Flashes will come through. Double molly is going to be used. They now have made their crossing. The CTs now. There's no saving. They have to go for this cuppa. Through the smoke, the op's gone. Op removed. Junior does his job. Plus some. Takes out that other opera in that one-to-one -one face off we've been talking about. And we haven't seen nearly enough. But this round could be the building block. The Lego block to build things up. Bombs down. Four versus three in the retake. Low util for the T's as well. They gotta move. They gotta go. Time is ticking, bad news bears. Mollies are coming in, but that should be it. They should have enough time. They have a kit. They're gonna need to get on this defuse, but I think they should just get it in time. B and B can definitely stay alive. This band-aid's still on. For how long? Yeah, it's a bad day that needs to be changed, Les. It's a bad day that needs a bandage, maybe. I was about to say, on that diffuse there, I thought we were going to see a 1G moment. I heard the lick of the flame. I'm like, please, no. Please, please, no. Don't end like this. <laughs> and it didn't. Heroics do come through there from the bad news bears. And they're calling the timeout, suiting off of that vibe. Like, listen, okay, I think I've got to read. What's it going to be? Like, for B&B, &B, we need to see early picks. We need to see just composure and the chaos that ensues from pain gaming's plays you can't deny it it's 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 hard to fathom 
It definitely is. And, and last time they played, I mean, this is starting to look like a little bit of a repeat because that second half, I mean, when Payne was on T side, they only lost two rounds, but it was just Payne gaming all over the board. And, and we're definitely seeing that again. Double ops for BMB. Shake Emble Jr. It's a little bit different. Oh, man. If they have the timing right, they won't peak this, but it is a big commitment towards lower B and also upper tunnels. Oh, there you go. good night. Good See night. You. Get out my server. Dooley's, a P250 and an AK. Far, the furthest from ideal, especially in a buy round, Dooley's. That, that spells the times, that hard econ and the upset that Bad News Bears is starting to cause. A few frowns over on playing gaming's faces here. I'm sorry. Okay. Now they have the site. And I believe that's Hardzal. He's in middle by himself. He hasn't hurt anybody yet. This could, this could be huge, but no, B Wells does have a better angle. I was thinking they were gonna try to go with the jump Hardzal. Could have pounced on that. The keys. Rifle bearer here, the P250. Looking Looking bleak and yet yeah, it's not going to cut the mustard to hold off the long push. The AKs, the N4 and the OP are going to be transferred, transitioned in to a double figure round. And that's 10, a, a, a glimmer, a shine of hope for B&B to get this done in two. Still quite a ways to go just yet. And from what we were just talking of sort of previous stats, 16-12 being how they lost this map and that potential, that opportunity is still there for pain. See if the scoreline can get a little bit better. Biggie Zero and Hardzow pushing over Biggie Zero with 94 ADR and Hardzow about, about around approximately, I think, about an 87. So they're definitely doing the damage they need. Junior. Oh my god! How does he land that? Banger. He, he misses flick of the wrist, but he got one fancy shot. Not able to make it two. A three and three already. It's still a minute and 30. Very different pace we're seeing from Payne. PKL missing it. Oh, but Ooh. Swisher! Ooh. That is so much better. The confidence, it's starting to rise. It's starting to surface here for B&B. &B. I was about to say, I didn't get a chance to even have a half breath, but the, the god oppers were down, but there was still a hero around. I'm really impressed with what we've seen across the board for B&B. &B. Whoever's got the op, it, it doesn't matter. They're just stepping up to the plate. Whew. Okay. Some life is back for Bad News Bears. Pain Gaming do have quite a bit of wiggle room. <laughs> there oh, there's no up. wiggle room. Yeah, there's no wiggle room at all now, it looks like. They want to end this, maybe. Yes, there's a reply back. A great opener. Hardzow, I think he just misses this molly. So no sound cue that it makes the oh, connect so on the feet. Oh, oh no. but B-Wills gets him. That could have been very impactful. Eagle shot was impactful. It's a statement piece, Laz. Oh, completely was. That was, that was phenomenal. I see your green cannon, and uh, I top you with an eagle. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. Swish up. Try and... Believing this Laz was told over at long. He's one, but the jiggle peak comes through. These eagle shots, the deadly eagle demons, but the operator, or as she did the op, I should say, and the USP pairing, the perfect pairing to get B and B to the 12th. Junior, toying with him. This player in CT, he drops, he what? drops! What are you doing? You cannot get away with that. It doesn't matter, I mean, the round goes for Bad News Bears, but I mean, there was so much damage that was given to B&B. Money taken away from them. They should be able to still have enough for weapons, but what a great round for them to just pick up multi-frags. I want to say that's the second time because we saw Bigger Zero run through that, that Molotov. 
eat in that first half. And the same kind of antics again, just the holding W strat when it's least expected. Deadly plays and oh my, the long play, they're back at it again. This has been so strong for Pain. Pain have been very successful getting long A control. Bad News Bears allowing them most of the time to go for this. They do try to mix up the playbook and go for that fight, but now it seemed like they realized Pain is just able to get that control. They probably realized through one of their tack timeouts, allow them to have it. Junior waiting. It's like hunting season. No lurks coming in from Cat, so it is a four-player commit. Having the lurk of safe just in the back of mid in case anybody tries to go for a flank. Junior. It's a little bit of uh, pressure back onto Pain. I'm not pushing this though. I'm surprised thought that Incendiary was going to keep him back a bit. The Napalm strikes. All the Incendiaries raining down on short. Raining down along as well. 42 seconds and it comes out to the time game. And it comes down to the frag rate. Two, four versus three. They're still pressing. They're still going for this. I mean, time is dwindling. Junior makes a bit of a tap. Connects under hard zone. So it will be the Molly. Nikki's going to get boosted. Oh, what is happening? Shake now if he gets the timing. There's no utility, so he can't wait for a flash. Junior might have been a distraction. So yes, Shake is able to find him. Hard zone sprays one. away. It's down to the one-on-one -on -one situation. Time is ticking. Swisher needs to come alive now. They've been fighting for this. Can they make this happen? Can oh. they continue this? Oh! He should be able to. He has the kit. He's got the time. We're going to a 13th round, and Bad News Bears are not giving up yet. That gave me flashbacks. And for any CSGO veteran, uh, a fan of CS, the get right play. Just trying to wall bang Ninja. Like, please, please. I need to get you taken out of this game right now. Musters up the courage, gets the wall bang, gets the wide swing, and gets them to 13 unlucky for some but bnb &B, oh, it's surely surely they could get this come back in the bag this is such a tight game you promised it and they're delivering lads these tack time mounts i think have really just changed the way that we're seeing from bad news bears oh oh but they go for the fight contention they will actually prevail they will be able to get this the trades are looking great b wills he actually makes that frag work as well so now pkl he's down to 22 B wills he can fall back. Run. He, he's a cat. He's got some lives, and I guess he's going to be able to keep them for now. And a big flank that's coming in from Junior. Look, he's already going through T-spawn. He might be able to take this offer down. He needs yeah. to be quick. But no, it's a Krieg. My oh. God, not like this. It's a two and two, just like that. Sleto's a nice knife, Junior, but put it away. That's not going to save the day here. Frags only, with bullets only. Spongy, be deleted too, and that knife welding moment could be it. Could take us to map three. Oh, a simple mistake. And it could be costly. Oh, B Wills. He's down to nine. Oh, he's making the sound cue. Oh, they know, surely. PKL, I don't know if he's heard this. He's still burning utility like someone's at car. B Wills, if he can get. This frag, this could be big. This could be important, but there's still 30 seconds. The bomb will get planted. No, but safe will hold the ground. Pain are pushing it to map number three. We're going to take no break. We're going right in.